Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I will show you how to make this bouquet. Especially, I will show you how to crochet this tulip. If you are new here, I'm sharing easy crochet tutorials in my channel. Please subscribe and turn on notification. Now let's begin. These are materials we will be using. Now we do our flower petals, and we start with a slip knot. Then we will chain 13. You can pause here to finish 13 stitches. We have 13 chains. We will then find the second space from the hook and work a slip stitch. Then a single crochet in the next space. Now a half double crochet next. Then we do one double crochet in each space and we do six double crochet. Here we finished the six double crochet and we got three spaces left. We first do one half double crochet and then one single crochet. Now in the last space we do two slip stitch. Now we move to the other side. We will repeat to first do one single crochet, then one half double crochet, and now six double crochet. Before moving on, we can cut off the tail. We got three spaces left. And we will do one half double crochet, one single crochet, then one slip stitch. Now we come to the end, we still do a slip stitch through the first space to close this round. And we chain 1 to start round 2. Here we need to insert the craft wear to support our flower petal. Now in round 2, we just do one single crochet in each space. Here we come to the end of round 2. We still do a slip stitch through the first space to close this round. Now we chain 1 to secure the end and cut off the yarn. Now we will do the flower heart. We will start with a slip knot and chain 6. Then we need to find the second space from the hook and work slip stitch. In this row we do 5 slip stitch. Now we 
we have five slip stitch, and we will repeat. So we chain six. And we do five slip stitch. Here we repeat it three times and come to the end. Now we do a slip stitch through the first space. Here we can cut off the yarn, so here is our flower hat. Now we cut a piece of uh, craft wear and insert it into the flower hat. Now we find green yarn and start with a slip knot to work our leaf. Here we work 28 chains. Now we have 28 chains. We will then find the second space from the hook and work one single crochet. Then another single crochet in the next space. Then we will do one half double crochet in each one of the next two spaces. Now we do one double crochet in each space and we do 20 of them. Here we go, 20 double crochet. And we have three spaces left. So in the first space, we do one half double crochet and then one single crochet. Finally, we do three single crochet in the last space and we will move to the other side. Now we come to the other side and we will repeat the same pattern on the screen. So here one half double crochet. Then 20 double crochet. While moving on we can hide the tail. Now we come to the end of the other side. Here we will find the first space of this round and work a slip stitch to close this round. Then we chain 1 to start round 2. From round 2 we will insert this craft wear to support the leaf. In this round we just work one single crochet in each space. Now we come to the three single crochet which we worked in one space in the previous round. And in the first space we still work one single crochet.
In the middle one, we firstly do one single crochet. Then we will chain one and work a picot stitch in the space I'm pointing at. Basically, a picot stitch is also a slip stitch through the space I'm pointing at. Now we do another single crochet still in the current space. In the next space, we just do one single crochet in each space until the end. Here we almost come to the end of the other side, and we got two spaces left, so we still do one single crochet in each space. Here we can put the yarn at the back of the craft wares, so that craft wares will be wrapped up by the yarn. Finally, we still do a slip stitch to close this round. Now we can cut off the yarn.